A social media post is making some people upset in the North State. We caught up with the man in the middle of it. A woman posted on Facebook that her father was yelled at by the owner of the McDonald's near Pleasant Valley High School in Chico. The post has since been shared more than 8,000 times with hundreds of comments about what happened. We caught up with the man at the center of it all today. He says he was on the receiving end of a few F-bombs from the restaurant's owner last week. KRCR News Channel 7's Tennyson Coleman has the story. I said, yeah, I cannot believe you're thinking that I'm stealing this. And he repeated, shut the F up. However, he spelled that all out. Rob Lambert's claims of verbal abuse at this McDonald's in Chico has created quite the uproar. I walked over to the counter. I asked the clerk. I said, did I not just pay you a dollar eight for this? And she said, yes. And I said, then I want my money back. And he again used that same term. Lambert says he was using his own cup instead of the ones provided by the store and that he's done this for years because he doesn't like wasting the plastic ones. But he says owner Mark Barrington started cursing him out multiple times in front of the entire store last Friday. Many people on Facebook are outraged, calling for a boycott of the fast food chain. I spoke with a Pleasant Valley High School student who says he was at McDonald's when the altercation took place. The manager did get in his face and just called him out on a whole bunch of stuff that wasn't true. Rob says he's reached out to McDonald's corporate offices multiple times over the last six days, and he's not too pleased with their response. Every day I get a same person saying, I'm so, so sorry this happened to you. We'll have our representatives get back to you. No one has gotten back to me. He thinks he's being given the runaround. I called Barrington's office in Chico and left a message. I also stopped by. Barrington was not available to comment on the matter. The store's general manager did tell me she was aware of an incident that took place Friday, but refused further comment. He is notorious for this. I'm not letting it go this time. I, all I can say is parents, do not let your children near any McDonald's until this man is dealt with. Tonison Coleman, KRCR News Channel 7.